Someone got shot. While it looks like the next first-person shooter game to hit the market, these computer-based training aids are only one small part of the newest regional training facility at Fort AP Hill in Virginia. The newly completed 49,000 square foot training support center allows the Army to store and issue gear, as well as provide shooting and forward observation simulators to support the training of an estimated 100,000 military personnel per year. It's used as a, uh, a means for soldiers, sailors, airmen, marines, interagency folks to come here and get training simulators and training aids to help increase the, uh, the effectiveness of their training. One of the new features offered by the facility is what staff members here call the retail area, which puts many of the training aids on display so planners can see and order items for their next training exercise. They can't believe it. The retail area, the stuff that they get to see now, they never knew we had. Items range from clothing appropriate for countries in which the service members will be operating to the latest in combat training gear, too. We have suicide uh, vests. We have a briefcase, you know, that, that is a bomb that you, you can set off. And even <laughs> improvised explosive devices, all designed to give those who train here the most realistic scenarios possible. I've been waiting a long time. I was beginning to wonder, maybe I won't go see it, you know, before I retire. But we got it, and we're proud of it. Proud of a facility which brings the installation into the 21st century and provides for a better trained war fighter. From Fort AP Hill, Patrick Bloodgood.